We are heading to New York City today, so you can't just choose any old pair of sneakers. I'm not even going with Jordan 1s today. I'm going with the Yeezy 350 V2s. Thank you. Yeah. Have a good one. Whew. Good morning, everyone. I hope every single one of you guys is having a great day. I'm having a great day. Matt, where are we right now? We are in Chicago, Illinois. We're in Chicago O'Hare Airport right now. Quick little layover, and then we're heading to New York City. There's no sneaker con in New York. There's no event in New York. I just sort of wanted to go to New York, and Matt wanted to tag along with me. I like New York. It's a fun city. Lots of fun things to do. I know a few people in New York are going to be hanging out with them this week. We're only there from, I guess today's Thursday to Monday. One, two, three, four and a half days. It's going to be fun though. Next few videos are going to be really, really fun. We have a couple hours layover in Chicago and then we get to get to get to New York. Can I be in it? If you want to be in it. Hey! This guy's building a house in El Salvador. That's awesome. Perfect. Good luck building the house, my man. That's like a, that, that's Euro. a record. Euro, sorry. Euro. So he'd break the all-time transfer record as an 18-year-old goalkeeper. That can't be accurate. I think that is the first time in my life that I've slept all the way through two consecutive flights. I'm definitely not complaining. Where do we find taxis? Dion and the guys from Puerto Rico. Wow, 12 hours of travel time to get to New York. That doesn't seem, why does it take that long? We are finally here though. We're actually staying in the same hotel I was in last year when I was here for SneakerCon New York, which is great because we don't need to waste any time figuring out where the restaurants are, where the subway stop is, where things are in relation to where we are. So we can just get right to it. I am starving. Oh my goodness, that was some much needed food. I feel way better. You know what I do when I'm feeling good? I go sneaker shopping. And since we're in New York, everything is bigger, everything is better. So we're gonna head over to the biggest and the best. It's it's actually the best, Matt. That's what I've heard. Foot Locker in the entire world. If there's one city to go sneaker shopping in in the entire world, it's New York. The amount of cool stores that they have. We're gonna be checking out a whole bunch of them. This is gonna be fun. is over, we are here. The biggest foot locker in the world. I think you need to buy these. I don't wanna talk about it right now. It's a Duke shoe, I don't care if they got knocked out, bro. It's a Duke, do you own a Duke shoe? I don't own a Duke shoe. Buy these, please, Matthew. Buy them for me? No, they're like $120. You think I made of money? Nothing too crazy on the Jordan Wall. We got Cherry 13s, Charlotte 10s, all the random stuff you'd expect to see that's been released in the past couple of months. Sometimes they have like crazy restocks here, like Pantone Pack, Maroon 6s, stuff like that that I got last time I was down here. Sadly, like these are amazing. I already have these, have these, don't have the, have the, like I have almost everything on this shelf. Price point? Not down to pay 300? That's almost like painful. Like it actually hurts a little bit. I've been telling you guys for a long time how much I like these ASIC Jelly Fives right here. You like these? Pretty good. I might buy these. Should I buy these? Nice salmon color. I really like these. Okay guys, we're in the Adidas section right now and they have these tubular dooms, which you know I love tubular dooms. This all white one. Whew. 160? 160. But then, but then, you thought that was good. 
They have literally the best shoe of all time. The pink tubular. Such. Why? Why haven't you guys bought these yet? Why are they still sitting on shelves? These are amazing. You gonna get Ultra Boost? Oh my goodness! Check these. The all white, crazy, explosive lows in prime. They're not like actually all white. There's like off white and cream in it, which makes it look a lot better. It's not gonna get dirty as quickly. It's gonna wear and age a lot better. I love these things. They're only 100, 140, so it's like a fair price point, I think, for Prime Knit and Boost. And I love these. Some other cool colorways are the Dooms, these ones, and these. I really these look like Stormtrooper type, like Stormtrooper type tubular Dooms. Okay, okay. These aren't too bad either. All red Hirachi is one, only 110. I thought Hirachi, weren't Hirachi is 120? Wow, so there's like a lot of stuff in here. Nothing that I really want to buy, unfortunately. Thankfully, it's New York, so there's only like 5,000 other sneaker stores to hit up. Let's go find another one. Wow, that's, look at this. That's a cool, would you call it a statue? Guys, look what we found. We found the NBA store. I like the NBA. Do you like the NBA? Like the NBA. Let's go in the NBA guys. store. Sup, bro? Okay. Michael Jordan, signed by Michael Jordan. You can actually buy these two. It's only 23 in the world. And you can buy the two and the 21, both signed by Michael Jordan, for 2,500 bucks, like the countdown pack. That's actually pretty cool. Look at the size of Shaq's feet. Size 20. Ooh. This is my hand. This is Shaq's foot. That you could hide a small child in his shoe. So many people, so many. What I'm trying to say is there's a lot of people. There's a Foot Locker and a Champs around here somewhere. I don't really know if they're good stores or not, or if they're just like regular run of the mill things. I feel like they must be okay because they're in Times Square. But we will find out in three, two, one. Okay, okay, Foot Locker, Times Square has a little bit of something, true blues. Just the regular Jordan Retros, Chair 13s, Ultimate 6s. These came out a while ago. Well, that was really short-lived in Champs. I said I couldn't film in there. I should tell them that I'm seated and sponsored by Champs. Maybe they would let me film in there. But that doesn't matter. Champs is eh. But we found Foot Locker, which I'm hoping will be a little bit more than eh. Yo, okay, okay, what do we got here? We got Kyrie 2 Champ Pack, just chilling here. That's that's really really cool. Yo, we got wool threes, wool twelves, da da da. da basically, all the Jordan retros that you see everywhere. And then these. Buy these guys. They're awesome. Okay, so we're at Times Square Full Locker. Yeah, I'm with my man Xavier. How you doing, bro? Chilling, chilling. How are you? I remember doing... you had came to 34th Street. Yeah, in November. In November for, yep. for Sneaker Con. Yep. I remember. I remember. That's awesome. No, uh, what's the best thing you guys got in stock right now? I don't know. We what's still up, got Michael? Michael. We got Michael. <laughs> I mean, we yeah, got all in. We still got yeah. the patch. We still got yeah. the patch. We got the heat right here. Wow, Full Locker employees are some of the coolest people in the world. Yeah, you know what? We, yeah, right we, are, we, are, we, we a family, you feel me? These are my little bros. <laughs> Alright, that was cut short again, but this time for a way better reason. So you saw all the guys there that watched the videos and knew it was up. They're all saying what's up and getting in the video and whatever, and their manager came over and he's like, guys, you can't be doing that. Come over here. And he calls over like the youngest one of the guys, and he was like chewing him out. Like, it looked like he was about to get fired, right? <laughs> it was like, it good. seriously looked like he was about to get fired for coming and talking to me. And then the manager got really mad at me and was like, you can't film in here. You need to stop filming. Except then one of the other employees was like, dude, don't worry about it. Keep doing your thing. And then one of the other employees was like, dude, you can't film in here. You need to ask permission first. My my motto with filming in stores is assume you're allowed to film unless there's a sign on the front of the door and keep on assuming that until they tell you you're not allowed to film. But seriously, the dude looked like, I hope you have your job, man. I hope you're watching this video and I hope you didn't get fired. If you do get fired, I feel terrible. I'm so sorry. So I think we're gonna wrap it up right here, guys. I am tired, it has been a long day. Tomorrow's gonna be a lot better. We had like 12 and a half hours of travel time today and we're exhausted. Tomorrow we're gonna be checking out a whole bunch of consignment stores and we're gonna be checking out one of the most famous basketball courts in the, actually just the most famous basketball court in the world. There's a pair of shoes I have my eye on that I wanna get at one of these consignment stores. It is going to be a great day. So if you guys haven't already, make sure to smash that like button on today's video. If you are new to the channel and haven't yet subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I will see you guys tomorrow. So until then, New York's awesome, and peace.